Hi, it's Steve, a handyman from the UK's Dad How Do I YouTube channel. Now, I got an interesting text this week. On Monday, as you can see, I got this text from my friend, which got me thinking, do you have any pallets? And she said, yes, I've got loads of pallets. So I was at work Monday, Tuesday. I managed to get round on Wednesday, which um, I had a look around, picked four pallets and then made a little sketch <laughs> and I've got it here. This is no joke. That is the only prep I did before <laughs> making this. And the brief was basically to make a house that could store eggs, but make it weatherproof and foxproof. So yeah, so she can put the eggs from her chickens in there. So this video, I, it took me one day to split the pallets and two days to build it. So have a look. Hello, Wednesday the 21st of February and I have just collected four pallets and you know what that means? Oh. Okay, I have the four pallets all stripped ready to start making. Base done, 45 centimetres wide by 80 centimetres long. Well, well, that's the width. That's going to be the width. So the door will go in that way. And there are the posts cut in half. They seem a bit short though. So we might need more posts. Don't know, but we'll see. So that's it on its legs. I've done the base and this is my sort of hip area. I want to be not bending over, I want to be just putting my hand in. Hand in, grab, grab eggs, put money, come out. So I think it's about the right height. There we go. Starting to take shape. Starting to be a box. It's getting there. It's on stilts. It's definitely taking shape. But it's getting dark so the plan is going to be for a roof that goes up and then down and a door okay this is the work i did in the dark update <laughs> sloping roof Now to put the roof on. Right. One side cut and placed on. It's a bit precarious. But they all kind of, they're the right length. I'm thinking seven centimeter overhang at the front to protect the door and three at the back. So yeah. Keep going. Roof on. That was very satisfying. The join's pretty good too. Look at that. And rustic. Rustic, but very solid. Okay, it's done. Put these little spinny things. There we go. Pop the eggs in. 
got a little slam slam bar there so I can slam it. There we go. Done. Done and done. For the finished article. So in answer to the question, how do I make an Xbox house that's weatherproof, fox proof? There you go. Stick it in there. Have your honesty box. You could have this painted black. X for sale. Free manure that way. Whatever you want. Kebab in a bun, job done.